Congratulations on completing chapter three. You have now got lots of interactive elements going on in your game. I hope you're now ready to be challenged though, because I have a three part challenge for you this time. So challenge number one is to add in another fire obstacle somewhere else in your room. So I've just put one in the corner here and you can see it behaves just like the previous one. Um, so we've got that, that is challenge number one. Challenge number two is when you collect the key card, I want you to do a print string to the screen to show that you've got the key card. So there you see, got the key card comes up in the top corner there. So that is number two. And then number three is actually happening up here. You might have noticed that my outliner is now looking tidy again. So I've left the door small and the key card out where I can see them. But in my storeroom folder, let me just close some stuff down. I now have a fire obstacles folder that I've added and everything to do with the fire obstacles is now in that folder. So you also need to organize your outliner as well. So just to recap, I want you to create one more fire obstacle. I want you to add some text to show that you've collected the key card. And I would like you to also organize your outliner to keep things neat. And then you'll be ready for chapter four, where we're going to start looking at creating our very own materials. Thanks for watching and supporting the channel. If you'd like to help me create more content like this, please consider becoming a patron on Patreon. The contributions I get through Patreon make a huge difference in keeping this channel going. Remember to like, comment and subscribe to make sure you don't miss my upcoming tutorials. Your support and engagement mean the world to me and help my channel continue to grow. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one.